What's up guys, in this video I'm going to be giving you a rundown of the new four features in Google Plus and basically just overviewing what Google Plus is for you guys and letting you know how it's going to compete with Facebook. Now this is still in beta form and I was actually able to get an invite because of my YouTube channel. Um, but basically there's four main features that I'm basically going to be talking about and then I'll let you know at the end how you can get invited and how it's actually going to compete with all the features that Facebook has and has recently released. So the four main features that are included in Google Plus are the stream up here, photos, profiles, and circles. And a fifth feature is actually a hangout. I'm going to be going through each of these and letting you know what I think about them. So basically as you can see here, I'm on my stream already. And essentially, before I begin the stream, I'm going to let you know what Circles is. So Circles, as you can see, is the people that you actually know. Um, I have a circle for my friends, I have a circle for my family, I have a circle for my acquaintances, and a circle for my following, who I'm following. Basically, you can add your friends, your family, anyone that you know, and following, I guess, is like Twitter, where you're not actually friends with them, but you want to see their updates, you can just follow them. Um, and you can also create your own circles with new people, which I'll show you how to do in a sec, and rename the circles, whatever you want. You can also see your incoming notifications here with people in your circles. And again, there you can see your notifications. That's when I actually was invited to Google+. Plus. So that's basically circles over here. Um, and this is the circles tab that I'm going to be showing you. Um, how you get to it, you just click the fourth tab over here. And this is basically who you know. Um, as you can see, it looks really nice. You can simply drag over a circle and see who's part of that um, family, acquaintances, whatever. It shows you who's exactly in your circles. Um, you can simply drag a new person to a circle and it will add them, such as as you can see there. I'm already in the, he's already in the acquaintances circle, but that's how you add new people to a circle. You can also add a new person by typing in their email or name to invite them to Google Plus by just by clicking over here, as you saw, which is really cool. Um, if you want to delete a circle, you simply right-click it, and you can either edit it, view a circle in a tab, view stream for that circle, or delete the circle, um, which is really cool. And that's basically how circles work. Up here, you have four tabs. One of them says people who have added you. You can find and invite people from your email, and you can, whoever I'm selected, it says who you selected with your mouse. So that's circles, basically. So I'm going to go back to the stream here. And as, you, as I said before, you can see all of those circles right here along the edge of the screen. And that's very cool. Um, if you want to see a certain stream, you can simply go there. As you can see, I don't really have too many friends yet. <laughs> but uh, that's where all their updates will actually come up. You can see your family here. Um, following, you can see all their updates. Um, and yeah, that's basically how the stream works. In the actual stream, um, you can plus one, which is similar to liking something on Facebook. You can comment, as you can see and you can share um, share however you want over your Google Plus account or however over Twitter and stuff like that um, and yeah basically that's how the stream actually works up here at the top if you want to share something you can post a photo as you can see you can create an album or from your phone you can upload a video from YouTube or your phone which I haven't tried yet I'll let you know how that works you can add a link or you can actually type in your location um, and let people know where you are. So that's really cool. That's what you can share in the stream. So, so far I've showed you the stream and circles. Now let's get to photos. As you can see, you can see photos from your circles, photo from your phone, photos of you or your albums. I haven't really added anything yet. As you can see, these are actually all of my pictures from my website, which I'm sure you guys know about. Um, and I'll show you how photos basically works. Um, you can simply go to the photos tab here or you can also I'll show you in a sec photos in a profile later but basically if you open up photos here you can simply click on one of them this is the interface and all of the photos are listed down here along the bottom which are which is really cool you can add tags you can also change all the settings in here by just clicking the actions tab you can also add a caption there um, when you do, I'm not sure if I'll be able to comment on these because these aren't actually real photos. These are from my website. Um, but you will be able to comment on something. Sorry for that pause there, guys. I was thinking. Uh, you will be actually able to comment on someone's photos, um, which I'll show you in a second. But that's how photos works. It's really cool. Um, you can scroll through them in the interface down here um, and it works really well it's it's a lot simpler than Facebook I think but it's it's good enough for now 
Um, and lastly, I'm going to show you profiles. Before I show you the whole profile, I'm going to show you photos because I just showed you photos. Basically, if you go to your profile picture here, you can comment. I'm not sure how to comment, actually, but I know you can comment. Um, you basically just click on the photo, and uh, maybe it's adding a caption. I'm not sure, but you can comment on photos, guys. Trust me. But the photo interface is pretty cool. Um, lastly, though, as I said, I want to show you profiles. Um, a lot of the features that they have are similar to Facebook. As you can see, you can see all your posts about you. You can see your photos. You can see your videos that you uploaded and you can see your plus ones which is rather cool um, I have also heard that they are integrating buzz over here which is Google's failed social network I don't know why they would do that but they are you can see all your friends down here and you can again see your profile pictures you can also edit your profile and change a lot of the stuff that you want such as your employment places invited etc um, and yeah it's very similar to Facebook in terms of the profile um, you can add everything that you can on Facebook and it'll be really interesting to see how this competes with Facebook so that's basically the general idea of Google Plus I like it a lot um, but the next feature I'm going to show you is Google Hangouts basically Google Hangouts is the video chatting feature of Google Plus which I think is going to be the most popular feature of Google Plus that a lot of people are going to like so basically to start a hangout you basically can go on the home page in your streams and as you can see here it says start a hangout so you simply click start a hangout and you guys should be able to see me in a sec and yet there I am basically you can start a hangout by simply doing that and by to add more people to your video chat so you simply click add circles to to the video chat and you can pick whatever circle you want to add to the chat um, and after you pick the people to add to the chat you can simply ha click hang out and it will start the video chat um, you can also mute the video down here as you can see mute the mic mute change the settings as you can see here you can pretty much change all the audio settings and whatever and change the quality of the video and you can also exit the chat um, and yeah I've heard that you can video chat with up to 10 or 20 people I will be uploading a quality test later this week um, for you guys to check out but uh, yeah that's basically how hangouts work and I think it's gonna compete with Facebook video chat very well that was released earlier this week which you can check out in a video on my channel um, but I think this is going to be the most popular feature of Google+. Plus. So that is Hangouts. I'm going to go ahead and exit out here. Um, but overall, guys, that was Google+. Plus. Um, that's an overview. That's all the features that were included. So hopefully you liked this video. If you did, please click the subscribe button above for more Google+, Plus videos, which I'm going to be uploading, obviously. And be sure to favorite and rate thumbs up in the description um, to the left of the video. Um, also, just so you guys know, I post a lot more updates on Twitter and my website as well as my Facebook page, so be sure to follow me on Twitter, visit my website, and bookmark it, as well as like my fan page in the description, and I will catch you in the next video. Peace.